Hi everyone, it's day three. It's Saturday, which means it's the weekend, which also means not only am I going to try one of these chilli sauces, I'm also going to try a funky flavoured cider. As we know, day one and two are a bit disappointing, but concerns have been quite rightly raised regarding me knocking back the uh, chilli sauces, because um, I am going to probably come a cropper at some point. So I've got a little spoon that I'm going to uh, pour a bit of the sauce into, and give it a go. If it's not that hot, then I probably will knock it back. But uh, yeah, let's get straight on to it. Day three in the corner. So this one is a habanero hot sauce. Can you see habanero? hot sauce um i don't know should a habanero be hotter than the cayenne pepper that i had yesterday not too sure i'm pretty sure it shouldn't be as hot as the uh ghost pepper i had but uh yeah i'm shaking it up to um i don't know <laughs> try and try and taste some chili <laughs> uh where's the slit got it right So open, here's my spoon. I've spilt it as well. Ooh, heat. I'm kind of glad that I didn't actually knock it back. Although, like I said, I've just spilt it. Um. Yeah, it was heat. It's not painful. It's still there. Um, it's quite a pleasant warmth, actually. I know a bit more. I do think that I might have regretted it if I had to knock this one back. Yeah, that one's quite um, quite pleasant heat. It's um, hotter than the first one, but I think there's something seriously wrong with the first one. Um, and it's hotter than yesterday's as well, but um, nothing to cause any concerns or issues. While well, I retrace, if I knock this back, might have a different um, might have a different response. Anyway, right, I'll just put this somewhere safe, and we're onto the cider. So this is a cherry colada cider. Um, it is apparently a cherry, pineapple and coconut flavoured uh, cider. Bought it from Sainsbury's. I think it cost me just over £2.50. 4% volume. Um, yeah, let's give it a go. Nipping. That's very coconutty, actually. All I can smell is actually coconut. Um, a little bit of cherry, maybe, but the the major um, smell here is coconut. Right, let's give it a go. It tastes a lot of coconut. It's supposed to be pina colada, isn't it? I guess. Well, cherry colada. Um, there's a little bit of cherry in there. There's a lot of coconut. I can't taste pineapple. Although if I concentrate hard enough, which I don't do regularly, mm, there is an underlying flavour of pineapple in there. Um, it's quite nice. Um, it's not something I'd normally go for. Um, I don't think I'll buy it again. It's a it's a coconut. It's a coconut. Coconut is kind of pulling me off a little bit. Obviously, as you know, I'll drink it all later. Um, for a funky flavoured 
Novel Tea Cider, it's not too bad. Um, I've tried it so you don't have to. So, uh, yeah, I just want to say thanks for watching. Tomorrow's going to be day four, which will also be another cider. And, uh, yeah, thanks very much and try a bit. Oh, yeah, and um, the Habanero, it was between 200,000 and 300,000 Scoville units, which kind of explains why it was hotter than the KM. Uh, we're ignoring day one, that was a complete mess up because that should have been far hotter. As well, the cider, I forgot to mention, um, it's not exactly fizzy, it's not exactly flat. Um, as you pour it, it fizzes, and then as you drink it, it's flat. And to be honest, that's a little bit off-putting as well. Um, but hey, I've tried it. Um, thanks, try a bit, that's all I can say. See ya.